and now, oh. Get out of my ring before I knock you on your old ass again. Yeah, I'm pissed. I've been pissed off for a long time. Because two years ago, I had thousands and thousands of people chanting my name city after city in a manner that hasn't been heard or seen in decades. I was the next big thing, but apparently the rocket that got strapped to my back was put on upside down, because ever since I have been driven into the ground and screwed over and over and over again. You would think the one true homegrown day one AEW original megastar would have been the champion a long time ago. But somehow I've never even received an opportunity for the heavyweight title and people back there need to be fired and thrown in jail for that fact. But let's look at some of the people who have held it. Because there's been a lot of men running around here claiming to be the best, to be better. There's kings, there's gods. So what does that make me? Because the best in the world, the real heavyweight champion, I beat his ass like nobody has in his entire career. His body's still falling apart from me. Which brings me to our former champ, the guy who's better than all of us and we know it. Yeah, yeah, your favorite. Well, guess what? I squashed him like an insect and beat him like nobody ever has in his career. Which brings me to the most dangerous man in the room. Our king, the current champ, Samoa Joe. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can somebody remind me what happened when him and I were in the ring? Oh yeah, that's right. I choked his ass out and I beat him too. Oh, and by the way, Big shiny titles and custom suits look a hell of a lot better on me. So again, I ask, what does that make me? Because it sounds like I'm the best in the world. It sounds like I'm better than you, and you know it. It sounds like I'm the most dangerous man in the room. I am the uncrowned king of AEW, and it is time that I start eating like one because I have been starving, and I am done being fed scraps. Look at me. Look at me. I am everything a world champion is supposed to to be. I'm the baddest son of a bitch to ever lace up a pair of boots. And there is no one back there bigger, stronger, or faster than me. There is no one that can stop me. And if anybody wants to get in my way, just know this is no longer wrestling. This is war! Well, Wardlow, to call that an impassioned delivery would be a massive understatement. Wardlow staking his claim as the uncrowned, uncrowned champion. Uh, he's saying he didn't get opportunities, but he named some pretty heavy hitters that he was in the ring with. But I'm a fan of Wardlow. 